I am Cybex author William Panic. In this video, I will show you how to create a resource record on a DNS server. Now to do that, the first thing I must do is open the DNS manager. The easiest way to do this is to click the Windows key on your keyboard. Now when you do that, you'll see that I already have a DNS icon. But as I've been showing in all the videos, I'm going to show you how to get to the DNS manager if that icon wasn't there. The easiest way to do it is click on administrative tools and then you'll see DNS is right in your list of choices so I'm gonna go ahead and just double click the DNS manager it'll open up if I expand my forward lookup zones and I choose Stellicon to create a record it's real simple all you do is right click on your zone and your records will start appearing. These aren't all the records that you can choose, but these are some of the more common records that we use. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're just going to choose a simple A record. Now it's going to ask me the name of the computer. So for example, we'll say it's computer one, and then it's going to ask me the IP address. So I'm just going to set it to be 192.168.1.90, okay, because that's the IP address for computer run. I'm going to say go ahead and create a pointer record, which is a reverse lookup record, because what we're creating right now is a forward lookup. So I'll say create the PTR record. After I choose add host, it's going to bring me back up to just a blank new host screen. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and say done and then you'll notice right here computer one is an A record that's not been created. If you need to create different resource records you would just continue the same process. You right click and you choose which records you want to create. Now if one of the records that you want to create isn't listed you just come down and say other new records. And at that point it brings you up so that you can just scroll down and choose which record you want to create. And it's as simple as that. In this video, I showed you how to create a resource record on a Windows Server 2012 DNS server.